Hey guys, what's going on? Back again with another cool piece of gear. The Arturia Micro Brute SE Monophonic Analog Synthesizer. Jesus, that's a lot. Anyway, big thanks to Moog Audio in Montreal for uh, helping me get my hands on this baby. Uh, apparently these are pretty hard to come by in Canada. So, thank you Moog Audio. But this is just a quick unboxing vid because I'm super excited to get into this and start playing around with it. So I'll make this one quick. Okay. So to start off with, I give you a nice little custom bag with it, which is pretty nice. It looks good at least. Let's have a quick look at this here. Nice, it feels a little cheap, but like I guess good enough to get the micro brute from point A to point B. Well, I shouldn't say cheap, just it's a $20 bag. Quit complaining. Pretty nice design on it too. I like it. Uh, now we get power cable. What else here? second piece of the power cable let's see oh yeah so the special editions come with a little patch cables but these ones if I can focus on them focus focusing uh, good enough anyway they're like little piggyback cables Oh god, it's not gonna focus. Too, too tiny. Too tiny. Sorry guys. But take my word for it. Feel pretty stable. Nice quality. Good enough, right? And you get two of them. So patch away. Bring from one thing to two. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. It's a nice little extra because they'd probably cost $5 each on their own. So, you know, I appreciate that little extra bit. But now for the meat and potatoes of this. Oh my word, this is actually... It's actually heavier than I thought. Like it's really, really weighty. Nice, yeah, nice heft to it. Definitely can smack a few nails into a board with this thing. Holy God. Oh, metal bottom. It's not all plastic, which is nice. Knobs aren't wiggly. That's uh, surprising for something at this price point. 300 bucks, give or take, depending where you are. Nice, I'm super impressed. <laughs> Nicely done, Arturia. The Arturia Micro Brute SE. Yellow. Thanks for watching, guys.